We've been uh, we've been rearing crayfish here at uh, Cunnery Couchy for the last well, nearly ten years now. That's uh, the, the white claw crayfish, our native crayfish. Now, um, what we tend to do, we'll take buried females from the wild on an annual basis. That's that's the egg laden females, and we'll bring them back to the hatchery and uh, and hatch the eggs here in a in a, in a controlled condition on um, on recirculated units. Um, the reason for that is that. In the wild, really, you're looking at sort of five percent or less survival. Where here in the hatchery, we can get in excess of seventy percent, sometimes in excess of eighty percent survival. Now, what we'll do then, we'll grow those those juveniles um, to maybe twelve months of age at the earliest, or sometimes a bit older, maybe eighteen months, maybe pushing two years, and we'll lease those into sort of specially selected arc sites. These arc sites, which we're we're choosing to to, to safeguard the species, they uh, they've got to be discreet from uh, from any Possible signal populations will need to be um, above impassable barriers or uh, yeah, maybe um, sort of discrete stillwater bodies. Now we're looking at the uh, the water quality of these sites. Um, it needs to be pristine, and uh, and, and, and crayfish are a really good um, indicator species for uh, for water quality. If you, if you've got crayfish in your stream, you know your uh, your water quality is pretty good. This year we've been back and, and surveyed a number of release sites in the uh, on the Y catchment. And we uh, we initially introduced juveniles there in 2012, 13, and 14. So we went back in 2017. Now we have found subsequently those original animals uh, in situ, um, but this year was the first year we found uh, first generation wild juveniles. So we actually managed to establish a, uh, a breeding population from introduced captive bred animals. So that's that's really. That's really encouraging for us and, and, and shows that the project is, is working, so it's, um, yeah, really excited about it.